Okay, so the next function that we're going to look at is the metronome function. So the metronome function is here. So if I press this button, it's going to turn on the metronome. And if I want to off the metronome, I can use the dial knob here to turn off the metronome. So there are a few functions in the metronome as well. So if I use this cursor here and I have, I can choose the tempo of the metronome using this dial knob, right? And if I go to the next page, it's going to show me the level of the metronome, how loud I want to hear the metronome. And if I turn here, this is going to show me the beats. Uh, if I want it to be in 4-4 four, four time signature or if I want in odd time signature, it's up to you. The next one will be the rhythm. If you want the metronome to count in quarter note or uh, eight note, triplets and whatever you want. So the next one will be panning the metronome if you want just the metronome to be on the right side of the ear or the left side. The next one will be the type of uh, sounds that you have with the metronome. So if I turn on the metronome again, this is type one. We have about 15 different types, I think. So we have the standard metronome sound. We have like this beep sound and also not forgetting one, two, three, four, one, two, three. the human count because it's quite important sometimes to practice with different sounds so that you get better with the metronome. So that's the metronome function.